this day, the killer was never found. What? Wait, I gotta sit and watch this. The neighborhood this. of Ellendor was left in shock. A man in his 60s found dead at his front lawn. Oh. But that was only his body. His, his body? Head is yet to be found. I took his head? The killer likely took it as a trophy. What's up, guys? It's Killer Variety. And welcome to Luggage. Today... We're playing as Steve. He has arrived at the airport from a camping trip and has some important luggage that he must carry with him. Oh, sounds suspicious. You know, when people come from an airport with luggage that's important, it's human trafficking or drugs. All right, guys, without further ado, we're going to jump into this one. Wish me some luck. <sighs> what a rough trip. <laughs> Whoa, that scared me. Oh, everybody's leaving the plane. Hold up. We arrived in Los Angeles. Los Thank Angeles. You for flying Hubris Airlines. Holy shit. For flying Hubris? Isn't that a blip? A, 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 isn't that a biblical term? Isn't Hubris like. What am I going to tell Jessica? Oh, no. She will never forgive me. Who's this voice actor? Wait, what is that? Oh, that's the window for the plane. Got it. This is the plane's uh okay. That's crazy. I guess that's his wife. Dude, you got bigger things to worry about right now. Don't forget your luggage, sir. You should see it on your way out. Okay, nice. They got my luggage up and ready for me. That's that's rare. She said I should see it on my way out. You look mad suspicious, bro. You chillaxing? Who are you waiting for? Look at you with the mustache, crimson mustache. Oh, it's the Clone Wars. Everybody's the same person. Yo, whose parents out here having trillions of kids with the same genetics? Look at this. This is down bad. Can you imagine a world like this? Can you imagine a world like this where everybody looks the same? You know what I mean? But that's that's where we're gonna get to eventually in the future. Won't come down to everybody having the same genes. We got clothing shop at the at the airport. Why is this a necessity? In case you travel without clothes. Who out here traveling but naked? Wait, where's my luggage? Hold up. I don't even know what it's supposed to look like. This isn't mine. Oh, okay, so I'll just recognize it. That's a creepy luggage. Who's who's lug I got some questions. Whose luggage does that belong to? There goes my luggage. Okay. It's a very plain you luggage. Use a payphone to call a taxi now. Can't I did one player to luggage home. to inventory. I got an inventory. I gotta get to a payphone. Is this the way out? Nobody told me there's no signs. There's, there's the bathroom. Oh, this is the bathroom. Can I go in? Listen, I got to take a dump. I'm under a lot of pressure. I got to relieve my bowels. Did I just follow these people? See if they leave me out of here. What's over here then? More of nothing. Nothing suspicious going on here. Just a guy came out of an air airplane, got his luggage going home. That's a dead end. Are these people waiting to board their flight or something? I seem very bored. This has got to be back in the day because nobody has a cell phone. You know damn well everybody be on a cell phone. That's the future we're living in. People are mind controlled by their cell phones. I'm one of them too. Can't blame, can't blame me. Can't blame them. Can't blame me. The hell? You heard a child? Is this the way out? Like, I gotta put up a little bit of a sign saying exit. Oh, okay. I think I see a sign. This mad blurry. Payphone. Gotta call a taxi now. Thank you for calling Eager Taxi. Not eager. I need a ride home. I'm at the Hubris Airport. Steve. Great, Steve. A cab will be on its 
not Steve. Like, like my name is is the most wanted name in the world or something. Exits that way. Why didn't he call the cab before? Had it prepared for him. Anyways, that lady did not sound like she's from Los Angeles. Sounded like she's from England or some shit. Creepy. Where's security at? Wait, ob obedience hammering you down? What kind of world is this? There's no security. Okay, I'm gonna follow these people. I wanna see a taxi. Let's go. Wow, that was quick. You don't even know this is for you. It is now, though. Oh, I'm home. Oh, sh oh, check my mail. No. Okay. I mean, I haven't been home in a long time. The mail got to be piling. Got to be piling. Home sweet home. Man, Man I regret camping with Gail. Who's Gail? Knew it was a bad idea. The heck you did with Gail? Go call him up right now. Wait. Call him up right now. What the heck I did with Gail? Yo, Gail, what we did? What we did, Gail? It's my crib. What? Wait. Till this day, the killer was never found. What? Wait, I gotta sit and watch the this. Neighborhood of Ellendor was left in shock. A man in his sixties found dead at his front lawn. Oh. But that was only his body. His, his body? head is yet to be found. I took his head? The killer likely took it as a trophy. A manhunt was underway for the unknown killer. With the only description of him looking like a camper. That was the only witness description of the killer. With what the police knew of him, they searched the woods near the neighborhood for any campsites. Police have reports of an airplane passenger who left the country matching his description. Oh shit, they're on to me. They will come busting down my door any second. How he got the severed head through airport security remains a mystery. What security? The There's Halloween, no security. 1970, a man was butchered at his home. See, I was right. It's the 1970s. This day, the killer was never found. Okay, TV, can I turn you off? The neighborhood of Ellendor was left in shock. A man in his 60s found dead at his front lawn. That's crazy. So I talked about a camper matching my description. Took a flight. They talk about me. What the heck I did with Gail? Yo, Gail, I gotta call you up, bro. Who we murdered? Why are we murdering a 60 year old man? Cutting off his head and taking it. For what purpose? Makes no sense. Damn, I cut off his head. It's in this. There was no security at the airport. That's how I got away with it. Yeah, I got to up your security. 1970s, bro. What I told you. Serial killers. Am I just going to go to bed after hearing the news? They're on to my crap. How he got the severed head through airport security remains. Oh, my God. What's this door for? Suspicious. A man was butchered at his home. Till this day, the killer was never found. Oh, I'm gonna open it? Was left huh? Wait, what? Ah! What? In the world? I was expecting a severed head, not Narnia. What the fuck? Am I reliving this nightmare again? Oh. So maybe when he opened the suitcase, the head was there and it just triggered a flashback of what I did. Dude, you can't run from your guilt. Who's that? Yo, is that you, Gail? What was I thinking? Is that me? What the heck am I doing? Oh, yeah, that was me. Oh, I was stressing about what I did. I wish I never thought about it. Thought about she what? just got the firewood and went back to camp. There's an axe. Oh no. Yo. Why? Just why couldn't I let the past be and moved on? 
What passed? There's another camp here. There's, there just happened to be another camp here, or is this our camp? Oh no. Ugh. I'm so sorry, Gale. I killed Gale. I'm sorry. Why you killed Gale, bro? Didn't Gale invite you to camp? Oh, you invited Gale to camp. See, people, you don't. Somebody invites you out into the woods, you don't go. You just don't go. Even in today's uh, age, you don't go. You can still get murdered. No one will ever, ever find you. Well, they did find the body, though. So my guy didn't do a good job of hiding it, to be honest. We gotta improve on What did I do with his body? How can I live with myself? I'm a monster. Oh, I buried it. How the fuck? How the cops find the body? I mean, he buried it two freaking inches away from camp. Oh, he wants me to follow. Why would I bury his his body, not the head? And why would I take the head for? Heck, where are you taking? Where are you taking me? I don't like going in. I don't like going to the cliff, the edges of life. I don't like that. Yo, uh, pass me. I'm going to do it this time. I'm going to kill myself. Maybe that's why I'm here. This guy is suicidal too. Oh, yo, stop, bro, stop. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Mother no! Luggage. Wait, what? I got questions. Like, I got a lot of questions. So we made it home. Obviously, he didn't went through with killing himself, and he took the head with him. So after opening the suitcase, that I went back out there. So after taking the suitcase, that I went back to the campsite, like at a, at a later time, and decided to kill myself because the guilt was eating me alive. Or was that just a nightmare? He just has nightmares like that. That's crazy. Doesn't change the fact that he killed Gale. What did Gale do to you? Gale probably took his woman. But Gale was like 60 years old, they said, right? Doesn't make sense. I, I don't. What the heck did Gale do to this guy? Who knows? But that was crazy. All right, guys. Thank you guys for watching. That was luggage. Make sure you guys subscribe and like down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. All right. Peace. Love you.